One person is dead and another person is facing second degree murder charges after a wrong way crash on the Loop 101. The Department of Public Safety says that this man, 25 year old Nicholas Sayovic, was impaired when he drove southbound down the northbound lanes of the 101. Team 12's Michael Doudna shares how all of this unfolded. Vehicle is southbound in the northbound lanes. Around 310 this morning, DPS started to receive calls that this man, 25 year old Nicholas Sayovic, slammed into a motorcycle, killing the rider. There's possibly an Audi at an exit at Chaparral. According to a search of the state's justice court system, a man with the same name and birth date was cited with DUI back on August 10th. But the court proceeding in that case is still playing out. It drives me crazy when I see. An incident like this, when I saw it, I said, oh my God, you got to be kidding me. According to safety expert Alberto Gutierrez, the death marks the 14th time in 2020 that someone died from a wrong way collision on Arizona's roads. So far, RV advising the vehicle is now at the 101 in Chaparral. Gutierrez says the death is frustrating after the efforts taken to stop wrong way driving, from thermal cameras to a DUI task force and more. Just sad. This is a very sad situation, I'm telling you. And those wrong way numbers are actually down. Compared to this time last year, DPS say there have been nine fewer wrong way crashes and five fewer deaths. We did reach out to Nicholas's family and they said they had yet to hear the news and were shocked, saying it was out of his character. We're in Phoenix. Michael Doudna, 12 News. All right, Michael, thank you.